of the outfit of the day. So in today's vlog, we are doing a little day in my life as a content creator living in LA, doing things alone. I'm going to just be showing you the reality of being a YouTuber. The first thing that we have to deal with is my phone because she is a broken. My cute pink iPhone 13 that I've been holding on to for the last two years is no longer cute. I literally shattered the entire glass on the back. It is officially time to say goodbye to this phone. iPhone 15 Pro Max. I got the black color. Let's open her up. Look at how pretty. My camera quality is about to be so insane. I needed some energy for today because I am now headed to this White Fox event that I got invited to in LA And I'm kind of nervous because I'm going by myself I'm having to push myself out of my comfort zone I'm gonna have to force myself to socially interact This was pretty cool. I basically got to go in there, pick out a few of my favorite outfits. I've always been so obsessed with their sweatpants and hoodies. Like their hoodies are hoodieing. Anyways, I felt so spoiled. I got to see the iconic white fox rooftop. Check out the new sweatsuit. On my way home, I stopped by Target to get some night routine essentials that I was missing. I got a new toothbrush, a tongue scraper thing, and I also recently got this new toothpaste. So we are now doing the night routine. I feel like today went by so quickly. When I got home, I was literally freaking out because I couldn't find my cat anywhere. And look where I find him. I cannot right now. On my way back, I had picked up some canes, which I already dug into, but this has literally been my recent obsession. When I got back earlier, I ended up just taking a nap because I just feel like I was all over the place. And then I ended up laying in bed trying to like set up my phone. And I wanted to show you guys what I have so far. So first of all, we have my lock screen. This is my first page of apps. I love the little to-do list icon that I added at the top. It makes me feel productive. And this is my second slide of apps. I organized everything into little folders. And then at the very top, I have this widget that just basically reminds you of everything you have to do each day. Another productive moment. And that is literally it. I still have to add more. Anyways, I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> Um, I cannot believe what I just got in the mail. Jerf Avenue, they sent me a package. I am literally so obsessed with their brand. One of the best parts about creating content and being a YouTuber is getting to work with your favorite brands. Look at how pretty. This isn't even sponsored. Look at how pretty the little gift bag is. The back even says to Angel Adela from the Jerf Avenue team. I'm in love. Literally these last months, Jerf Avenue has been all over my Pinterest boards, especially their cute robes. They literally sent it to me. Look at how beautiful the print is. And to go with the robe, they sent me the matching towel. Then in the little bag, they sent the cutest little basic white tank. Sent me one of their sets. I cannot wait to take my everything shower this morning.
content creator is that I have to spend literally my entire life on my phone. Like I am glued to my computer screen and my phone screen 24 seven. And my vision is bad enough as it is. If you guys didn't know, there was a point in my life where I was having to wear glasses like 24 seven. And then one day I just decided to stop because I hated the way that I looked in glasses. And now my eyesight just sucks. Today I'm going to get an eye exam and look into getting a pair of glasses. Eventually I do plan on getting like laser eye surgery. Okay. Also check out my new phone case. I also stuck a little charm on it. Can we take a moment and talk about the way that I look in glasses? You guys should totally comment your favorite pair in the comments. I was basically told that my eyesight is terrible and the reason that I always have headaches is because I am straining my eyes too much and I need glasses ASAP and I have to wear them 24 seven. So that is great. I'm currently in the middle of writing in my planner. I do want to say that although adulting is hard and I constantly have a million responsibilities, a never ending to do list, the main thing that I've been trying to work on is having balance. Something I've started to realize is that you can't have this without this. As much as I love staying home, I do have to remind myself to stop being a grandma and get out of the house. And speaking of which, literally tonight I'm like trying to get this done before I go out and enjoy my night because I do have one more event this weekend that I have to attend, which I need to start getting ready for soon. Like after a night out, these just do something to me. I actually really like this brand. It doesn't taste bad. This morning was spent at the vet. I took my cat for the first time. Since of course I now have cat mom duties, it was time for him to get neutered. He got checked up, got his shots. We are making sure that he stays a chunky, healthy kitty. While Mr. Kitty is at the vet, I'm gonna get my nails done because they are crusty. I'm currently in the car looking for nail and spill on Pinterest. I'm thinking of getting something like this. I think these like black tip nails with the little pink bow is so cute. I somehow deleted the footage of how my nails turned out, so here's some pictures. <laughs> Oat milk and then I put the cinnamon foam on top. This is a uh, this is actually really good. <laughs> This day was kind of all over the place. After I spent hours at a coffee shop, I went to go grab some food with my friend Emily. We went shopping, got some cute stuff for a self-care night, including Hello Kitty Boba. p.m. it was time to pick up my cat from the vet and i am now stuck with mr cone cat for the rest of the week wish me luck guys i posted this cute little instagram post of my cat i did finally end up naming him we named him leo look at how cute and since I do plan on eventually getting a second cat, eventually they will be named Leo and Luna. I thought I would just give you guys a little kitty update. I also made him an Instagram if you guys want to go follow him. Such a cuddly, clingy cat. I hope you enjoyed this little weekend in my life. Comment down below some videos you guys want to see for me. And I will see you next week. <laughs>